and drivers going on a crash course right into a church, leaving four people injured. Now we're hearing from family members of one of those victims. Local 10's Rosh Lowe joining us live from Northwest Miami Dade with the latest. Rosh. All right, everyone, let's go on a little walk here. I want to show you a couple of things. First off, there is the surveillance camera. You'll see in the story all of the video that this camera caught as we pan down. You can take a look at the damage. She has a broken bone in her neck and a broken bone in her spinal. Willie Norman's stepdaughter still in the hospital following this surveillance video captured that crash in Northwest Miami Dade. It happened just before 1 a.m. Thursday morning. Two cars colliding and they come barreling towards a church and debris goes flying. You can see the silver Kia actually crashed in reverse and then about a minute later, several people rush in to help. A man is able to pull a passenger from the orange Challenger who's writhing in pain. The next clip picks up about 10 minutes later, showing police and paramedics hard at work on the scene. Four people rush to the hospital. Among the victims, 21-year-old Ashante Scott, seriously injured. She underwent a successful emergency surgery. We don't know much, but we do know that it, it, it was very dark on that street. It's construction. There's no sign of sand construction. There's nothing that lit up the sand construction. And right now, her mom is very, very devastated. And she's taking it real hard. But again, we're a prayer for family and all. We're just trying to keep all our spirits up. Family members say 33 year old Philip Hart was the driver and only person inside the Kia. He had a, a, a brain bleed, he had been in an accident. The father of three is currently in intensive care, and Ashanti's family asking for prayers. She's 21, she's very young, and um, she got a whole life ahead of her. So it's, it's more. We just want her to just recover. So you heard there from the stepfather, he is asking for your prayers. We have multiple people still in the hospital with serious injuries. We're live tonight in Northwest Miami-Dade. I'm Rosh Lowe, Local 10 News.